Hey, everybody. Welcome to another episode of WP the Podcast. I'm David Blackman. And I'm Tim Streifler. Today in episode 805, we're going to talk about how to back up your WordPress site to Google Drive free and easy. Tim, we got to make sure of that because there's a lot of solutions that will do this, but they might not be free. So we want to point out some of the ones that are free. And honestly, just about any backup plugin is going to give you an option to, you know, back up your site to Google Drive. But I think one of the most important things of why you may want to do this is because if you have a Gmail, which is free, uh, Google automatically gives you 15 gigs of space. Yeah. Well, that's, that's a lot of space. So um, typically websites are not that big. <laughs> so having a, a, a backup stored there uh, on Google Drive is just a, a really great free solution to have. Now, some of these plugins that take it from WordPress website to Google Drive, which Tim, I guess, will talk about some, they may not be free options, but they're they're relatively inexpensive as well. Yeah, and obviously having a backup is crucial. That's obvious. We've talked about it many, many, many times here. The importance of having good backups, but you don't what you don't want to do, and and is is backup the site. And I, I don't. I imagine now most of the backup solutions like we'll warn you of this, but it used to be like the early days with backup plugins, you would back up and it would, it was stored on the same server, right? Yeah. Where the only thing that that's handy for is if you need to roll back because you screwed something up, right? User error, the web, the server's still live, but you screwed something up. So you got to roll it back. However, if the server completely crashes, right? And everything is lost. Well, those backups go along with it. So it's like, right. Like, why would you want to, it's like, uh, creating a, uh, you know, a copy of all of your important documents, you know, and then keeping it with the original. It's like, what's the point of that? You know, if there's a fire, the back, the copies go out with the originals. Right. So having it backed up to a third party, uh, server cloud hosting, is the smartest way to do it. Yes, you could download it to your local computer and that's good to do from time to time, but you want to be able to automate it. And so you can automate it with a backup plugin and have it uh, automatically sent over to Google Drive. And as David mentioned, Google Drive is free uh, with uh, a Google account. So it's like you already have that storage. Why not use it? And so uh, David, do you want to talk about the free solution? I can talk about some of the other ones that, that are premium. Oh, I don't even have the free solution open, Tim. <laughs> so I'm a the, terrible host. I'm a terrible host. So the free solution is Updraft Plus. So Updraft okay. Plus has become a very uh, popular and reputable uh, free backup solution. Now they oh, do have wow. premium add-ons. I didn't add-ons. it was free. Okay, cool. Um, so it's, it's a freemium solution. So they have the free version of the plugin that has functionality and then there are uh paid add-ons as well okay. um so yeah you can't do absolutely everything that you'll need um but the ability to um save to google drive that's that feature is is free which is pretty sweet awesome well i think that's it do we even need to give them any other paid solutions tim um, no, I mean, just as David mentioned, any, any backup solution that you're already, already comfortable with is going to have, uh, the ability to send to Google drive or Dropbox or Amazon S3, whatever. You just might have to pay for those extensions. Um, one of my favorite backup plugins is all in one WP migration because it's just, it's stupid, simple. There's, yeah. it's not cluttered up with a ton of settings and complicated interface. It's just it used to be free too. Is that one still free? It's free, but to have it automatically go to like Google drive and stuff like that's a paid extension. So it's a freemium gotcha. model as well. Okay. All right, cool. Well, there you go. How to back up your WordPress website to Google drive free and easy. Check out Updraft plus any of the other options as well. Should you choose to go a different route? Tomorrow, we've got another great topic, the importance of adding automation into your business. Tim, until tomorrow, we'll see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.